All right, many of you have asked, what is in my location and tech scout kit? Well, I'm about ready to reveal it. First thing that comes out is the Canon 1DC. Uh, I love this camera. I uh, am able to frame beautifully with it because I'm able to shoot in Super 35 mode. I want the director to really understand what the look of the movie is going to be. So I'll take all these references of the location, just in natural light, nothing that I'm lighting, along with a lookbook that I have, but once we visited the locations, I go back and I color correct them in Photoshop and then show them to him or her to make sure that we're all speaking the same language. I always come with gloves uh, because you never know what the hell you're gonna be up against. So you always have some gloves on board. I have uh, a tape measure. So after the director has gone off and he's having other conversations, I am taking my 30 foot fat max and I'm already seeing, you know, if I can put wall spreaders in here. I'm measuring how tall the ceiling is. I am measuring how, you know, wide, how long the room is, just taking in kind of measurements so I can uh, take that all in. And what I do is I draw a schematic of the location right on the script. Usually the first page of the scene, I'll flip it over. I never double print. I, I wanna be environmentally safe and double printing scripts, but I never double print a script uh, on two pages. I always have a page where I can pull out my cheetah pencil. It's gotta be cheetah. And I'm able to draw the room. So, you know, I'd say, okay, this is the entryway, there's stairs up here, uh, this is the doorway, there's a door there, you know, and I got my windows, uh, I got another window back there, I got a corner, I got another door, I got this, and I got the entrance to the kitchen. So I draw the whole schematic out. And I, so I have that reference in my head along with the still photography stuff because when we talk about blocking, I mean, you gotta understand, you're seeing 20, 30, 40, 50 locations where you're going through all this. You gotta write this stuff down, right? So I'm drawing this so I have in my mind what Stefan and I talked about on the scout day. I carry all my meters because I wanna be able to see what the, the light is in here just at, you know, at 500 ISO, because that's what I rate my red at, uh, you know, I'm just trying to figure out, I mean, I already got like just an 11 in here. So uh, just this with the natural sunlight. So I know I'm gonna put curtains on the windows, I'm gonna put shears, that's gonna reduce it. But I just like to go around and see what uh, the light levels are. I'm always carrying my C700 color temp meter. If there's any kind of funky lights at a location, I wanna know what those colors are and then I can make sure that you know my gaffer knows that and we have to order those specific globes or fluorescence or whatever. All these things are things that this meter can educate you about. I always bring with me my nice little compact meter. So I'm able to meter power just in case. If we uh, have been told it's an independent film we're gonna have to tie in, then I wanna be able to go over to the box and see what kind of amperage we have and uh, just do a little intel on that as well. I have a swatch that I always carry with me. So this is my favorite color palette uh, from Sherman, Sherman Williams. Sherwin-Williams has all these incredible historical palettes. Uh, you can see this is like what we know is every color in the rainbow. And I usually reduce it down to like 28 shades is all I usually work with. 
because you can get so crazed with like every shade of gray, every shade of blue. Sometimes I sit there and I'm like, oh, could it be this one? Well, maybe just a little lighter, Oh, maybe a little darker. I always go to my historic colors. These things are golden. They just do so many great things for me. Even if it's not a period piece, I'm always going here for inspiration. I have my script and I have usually an iPad. I have this iPad that I take with me so I'm able to access storyboards. I'm able to bring up the script if I wanna do on that. I'm able to access the schedule. Uh, all these things kind of come with me so I have that on board. Like our YouTube channel and follow us. We're out there, we're slinging it. We're sharing the knowledge. I have the passion, I have the inspiration. I love talking with all of you and sharing 30 plus years of experience.